What is up, guys? Lord Chocolates in the third here. Though, if you notice my channel name, you'll notice a small bit of a change. So I know I did an update video already, um, but that video is actually going to be deleted in place of this one because more updates have been coming out from my personal life that I want to give to you guys. Some of you may have noticed this on Twitter if you follow me. However, I wanted to give all you a video update to show you guys what's going on and what will be going on. The first biggest thing, this is probably the hardest news I've ever had to give on, in terms of a platform. Um, however, after a ton of research and soul searching, I have actually come out to realize that I am in fact transgender. For those of you who don't know what this means, while I am male physically, mentally, I am a woman. Due to this, I have been working on po the possibility of transitioning to a female, along with vocal training to sound more feminine. So I would respect if you guys would refer to me in comments and mentions as she, her, instead of he, him. Now there's one, the, one other big change that I wanted to bring up as well, so that, you know, you're not only staring at this big black screen and should see something. Hello again, everyone. So one other big change is that I really wanted to get back into streaming. And I wanted to do that with a webcam this time compared to the last times, but never really had a way to do that especially now where I don't really want my face all over the internet. That's already there, but trying to go forward, trying to push those back a little bit, you know what I mean? So, this is Charlie. This is the VTuber model that I wanted to make and that I used, that I did make in a program called Vroid Studios. This is my first model, and I did what I could, and while I accept criticisms, I would respect if you guys were a little bit gentle, because the program I used wasn't fully user-friendly, so because of that, I did what I could. But I still think she came out really cute, and I really like her, and have been having a blast using her for the streams and stuff like that. So, let's go ahead with some questions that I thought maybe need explanation for the future for hopes that it can clear things up for anyone who decides to watch the video. Before I get to that, though, I do want to mention that while I, qu while I go through things that I think of that should be answered. If you guys have any questions, please leave them in the comments, and within reason, I will answer them to the best of my ability. So, question number one. Where do I stream, and when do I stream? So when I stream, I always stream on Twitch. I also have the opportunity to uh, stream on YouTube as well. However, those would have to be, those would generally be dual streams, and while I would love to do that, it's completely dependent on my internet. So my internet can't handle streaming to both platforms at once. Unfortunately, there's not really a way to, uh, um, there's not really a way to do it if my internet isn't that great. So that's up in the air right now. However, I will be testing this at some point in the future. So if you happen to see a stream on YouTube, most likely that's a test stream. And then um, we'll see what happens from there. If I get to continue it, awesome. If not, well, it is what it is. So when do I stream? So I mainly try to go through Tuesdays, Thursdays, and sometimes on the weekend. But sometimes it's not always possible. So if I'm not streaming those days, then most likely that's what's going on. Um, but I will always notify everyone via Twitter when I do start streaming or any discords I'm a part of. Um, two, am I going to continue to support the YouTube channel as well as bringing back any of the old projects? Examples being New Vegas Mainly Only Run, Borderlands, and the Halo streams. 
Will I continue supporting the YouTube channel? Yes, that is in the plans to continue it. But please realize that while the reason for the hiatus in the first place was because I do have a full-time job. So while I try to contribute as much as I can to the channel, that unfortunately isn't always going to be the case because of the fact that I have that full-time job. Um, now, in terms of the projects that I had before the hiatus, so again, Borderlands, Melee Only Run for New Vegas, and the Halo streams, unfortunately, the answer is going to be no. Uh, whatever's not on YouTube currently will most likely never be on YouTube. So for Borderlands, as you know, that was a project that I did with my friends, and we did basically the beginning of the end and some of the DLC before we stopped playing the game entirely. Um, I don't know. I haven't checked on the channel in terms of the videos in a while, so I don't know what exactly, um, what exactly we left off on in the last episode, whether it, we did end the game and just started the DLC, or we were in the middle of near the end of the game. Regardless, unfortunately, due to time, whatever footage I had of the game is unfortunately gone. So even if I wanted to continue, there's no way I could bring it back. And my friends don't really want to re-record that. So it's just mainly going to be left where it is right now. In terms of the Fallout uh, Melee Only Run, unfortunately, it's going to be the same thing for that as well. Um, mainly because we, uh, sorry, I, one, not only don't have the same file anymore, I also don't have the, um, the, the mods that I was using to, for quality of life improvements. So, while yes, we can continue with the mods that we got if i could try and find them because of the fact that i don't have the save file it's not as easy for that part because i would essentially have to play from the beginning of the game again up till the point i got to and with that full-time job i mentioned it's not exactly possible for that so i think it's just best that we leave that where it is right now that being said will i continue to produce more fallout content because of the fact that New Vegas is my favorite game. Yes, I do plan some form of content for New Vegas that I'm not sure what exactly it will be on, but I do plan on getting to it at some point. Um, just in terms of the melee only run, that will most likely just be left where it is and maybe even start it back up in terms of a brand new playthrough. But for that exact playthrough, that's unfortunately done. Um... In terms of the Halo streams, those were just streams I was uploading from Twitch to YouTube, full VODs of what I was doing. So um, the VODs are unfortunately gone, and there's not going to be a way to bring those back. So, yeah, those are that. Um, next, do you still plan pursuing a career in voice acting? Absolutely, yes. So, for those who did watch, who did not watch the last uh, update video while it was up, I did state that I was going to start a career in voice acting. Um, and while that is the case, that is a long-term goal. So, we'll see how the long-term goal goes in the future while I continue with streaming and the YouTube channel and everything like that. Um... Next being, speaking of the old video, can you explain more in detail why you're deleting it? Well, I mainly did the video as a form of growth to show how much better I was doing in terms of the voice acting. Um, and while I did feel like I've grown a lot in that video, I didn't want it to be the staple to show, especially the potential of it because being somebody's first experience with my voice. So 
<coughs> excuse me. So I didn't want to keep it up with any other videos that came afterwards because that's maybe somebody's first video and it may be before I'm fully ready to try and pursue voice acting fully. So while well, again, it was great to see the growth I made then, I'd rather wait to show any more of my voice acting stuff before I'm fully ready to get out there to the world. So unfortunately, the video has to go. Um, that is, oh, um, one more thing. Do you have any social media? So this basically, um, yes, I have two forms of social media. So I have a Twitter account that's going to be at Chuckleton underscore. And that's mainly where you're going to see posts of my daily life along with some shit posting memes and stuff like that as well. Um, at will, again, also be where you see announcements of when I am streaming. In terms of other social media, I have a TikTok channel as well. Uh, that is also at Chuckleton underscore. So both of them have the same at. Um, that one is mainly just used for random videos, uh, random clips from the streams I do and stuff like that. So, of course... Most of these, you'll mainly see this face until a much later point where I feel comfortable showing my face as a woman. So I know that was a lot of information. Um, and if you stuck around to the end of this video, thank you. I understand as well, some people may not be keen to this news. And while I may disagree with your choices... If you feel like you have to unsubscribe, I definitely understand. Um, my only wish for everyone watching this video is please be civil in the comments. If anyone decides to leave any disgusting comments, they will be deleted and the person will unfortunately be blocked. Um, but for anyone who is going to stick around and just even watching this video, thank you to all of you who decided to stick through this all. And anyone who want to continue with this journey for me, with me, um, I hope to continue seeing. I hope to continue seeing you in future videos, as well as Twitch and all this other stuff that I'll be a part of. And for anyone who doesn't want to continue, well, I get it. Enjoy your life. So. That is all. And of course, as always, I hope you all have a fantastic rest of your day. Bye-bye.